need toilet paper rolls. I'm Winter, and to the Super Fat Adventures, what do we have left here? Did I put my iron rolls in here? I did. What can I do with the iron I currently have? And what should I focus on next? Uh, maybe I will uh, try to... First, let's not forget to have some mushrooms on us every time. Let's have also this other bowl. I think I can make more. Blah! I'll go with this. I don't need the rice stone. But the bread is all can, could always be useful. I feel like I need another chest so we can do just that. And we can craft. Uh, uh, I guess I'll have to move this. You can craft. Because not to craft kingdoms. I'm gonna finish that, I promise. <laughs> uh, I believe I will try to accomplish... Have we done this? We have done this! Give me that! Uh, do, we, do we have netherrack? We have netherrack. <laughs> we have done this! We have killed all the, the ghasts! We still haven't gotten a single case for the spawner, not found stronghold. Enchanted table, rich nether... We have three iron ore so far and no gold. So I guess we'll focus on the next one <laughs> in the list. We'll go with the pigman. How much wood do I have on me? I don't really need wood, thinking about it, because if I'm going to build anything at all, I should build it out of cobblestone entirely, because this is going to be a problem. I could actually have a fishing rod here if I feel like I need to find to fight the ghasts. Uh, I will head towards an area of my choice, maybe a bit far away from my. Uh, where is my original spawn point? I think it's that. Oh, it's that way. Well, I'm pretty sure it's not here. So I suppose I'll try to do something where I can get in, but big pigmen cannot reach me, and I can hurt them. Let's see, if I do some sort of hole like this, and I cover it in cobblestone, I'm going to experiment right here on screen for the first time. I honestly have no idea what would work better. I suppose if I had water, I could build some sort of trap that... Uh, could uh, make pigment fall in it, but uh, no access to water yet. And this is the reason why this thing will be made entirely out of cobblestone, because otherwise guests are going to ruin my day. I hope I don't have to farm any more cobblestone, because that could possibly be boring. Nobody likes farming. Farming cobblestone. <laughs> I don't even have lava to actually produce some, so for now cobblestone is not renewable. Let's cover this see more cobblestone. Maybe I can make... Uh, up, up, ouch. Maybe I can make some of those fancy cobblestone walls I've been hearing so much about. Uh, I need to make sure pigmen cannot get... Uh, wait, if they get stuck here, it's actually not, a ba not bad. They make some sort of hole. Wait, they can reach me. They can hit me through here. Unless I stay here, maybe? Hmm, this would actually be dangerous. Maybe I have to make double sure that I'm in an area that they cannot reach. Like this. Hopefully. And then have a sort of wall around me so that I can hit their knees. Would this work? Am I able to reach them at all? If I'm moving at their knees, can they hit me? Even if they're one block closer. This needs so much experimenting and at the same time... Oh, look at where that gas spawned. At the same time, I don't want to experiment with pigmen. Once I hit one, it's never on Earth. Which is actually the point of this season. Why do I hate myself? <laughs> I need more cobblestone. Time to... Get some cobblestone and also eat some food to make sure I can heal because uh, you are what you eat and currently I am made of mushrooms and so I'm kind of fragile. Get a fireball in the face and just going I'm going to melt on the spot. They're kind of hot. I don't have any more cobblestone. How much do I need? I just need to kind of surround myself in cobblestone, so probably uh, 15 pieces of cobblestone are going to be enough. 
something like that, except I don't have cobblestone on my bar, so I don't know much of mine. 13, because I'm keep on capable of counting and talking at the same time. Unless I am saying the numbers out loud, and that's boring. Hello world, it's still night time, and I'm... Um, oh, uh, this way? I hope that's the direction where I'm building the thing, because I've already... Okay. <laughs> Uh, forgetting, forgetting things somewhere. I'm doing great on coal for now. Now I'm out of um sticks and cobblestone on my bar. These guys will do great uh, for my for testing this little area, little area I've built. And I just need to hit one of them. Boink. Hello. Right. So they're trying to climb up here, but I cannot. Uh, can you hit me? You cannot hit me. What if I get a bit closer? Oh, you still can't hit me, which is really good. I have this whole area to myself and you cannot reach me no matter what. Plus, it does look like they indeed are trying to reach me in a straight line, although this can't be really tested. I, I would need... Whoop! Oh, 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 oh yeah, okay, they can hit me. They can hit me through that, so I do need to surround this little part here with cobblestone so that uh, uh, it's at the ground level and ghasts cannot ruin it. Now the only question I have left is... Uh, uh, what's the question that I have left to answer? <laughs> oh yes, the stone sword is not going to last me too long, is it? Don't fall in there, you're dangerous if you're down there. Just going to that. Those pigmen in the background are not angry at me. I'm glad they aren't, and I should be eating. Am I still hearing the bad guys? It does not appear that somebody is currently mad at me. I sure hope that's the case, because I am scared right now. Uh. Okay, this cobblestone is not going to be enough, but I don't see any pigment sheet. I take it back, I take it back, I take it back, 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 back. Very, very bad, very bad. You can't hit me from there. You're not. You, you can't. So, pigmen tend to get very mad at you if you do stuff that, like hitting them in the face or in the knees with a sword. Today we're learning science and also a tiny bit of social psychology. How to approach people, not be hated by them. So notice, kids, if you're trying to make friends, do not hit them in the knees with a word made of stone. Also, they do not like to be hit uh, by any other kind of object, uh, solid object. Uh, you can try with pillows, but try to make sure that they know what you're doing and don't surprise them. Let's walk around those pigmen, make sure that they're not angry. Let's see if those ones so far away are angry at me. You are not, I'm really glad. So the range does seem to be something like maybe 50 blocks? Tend to get some extra cobblestone. I guess I could have dug up cobblestone from below that uh, trap thingy. Also, I haven't kept the track. Uh, no, let's not uh, eat bread. Bread's important. Bread's currently semi non renewable. <laughs> um, what's. I haven't counted how many pigmen I have killed. Again, I am capable of counting while talking about different things. <laughs> So, I'll leave this up to my future self uh, in post-production to figure out how many pigmen I have killed uh, and whether this objective has been accomplished by the end of the episode or not. And besides that, uh, let's see, news, news, there is some news, there is some news that we'll talk about uh, in hopefully a couple of weeks and it's going to be awesome, it's going to be really really awesome, but for her. Uh, for myself, even though I suppose it will affect my YouTube channel a tiny bit, so it's going to be awesome for you as well. Some stuff that 
you are going to enjoy has been recently recorded, but um, I did some weird things here with the placement of the cobble. I can't quite tell how long it's going to take before it will be out. Hi, pipe, pipe, pipe. I made some extra tools. I am uh, full of mushrooms right now. No, 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 no. That numb was a bit laggy, but it's okay. It still works. Are any of you guys angry at me? It's a shame the only equipment pigment drop uh, is made of gold. It's really not going to last, and this pigment is not angry at me. Oh, oh, it is, it is. It, it was having issues finding me, but it found me. It fu the pigment found me. Pigment found me, and I should have had cobblestone on my bar, right, really. This pigment is angry even though it's not making the noises. Uh, make the noises, pigment. Oh, I didn't want you to jump on my thing. I was just... <laughs> I almost put myself in a terrible situation, but no, I was just trying to get the drops. Uh, poor Pigman is trying to jump here, but it's failing at it. Let's uh, complete our masterpiece, hopefully while staying alive. I suppose this works. It's not really that complex, but I do have some redstone actually, and some iron. I could make pistons? And then use those pistons to my advantage. Are you coming? Fishing pigs right now. Let's. Oh, I'm hitting the ceiling, I believe. Maybe. Will you? Oh! Nope. Bad. I need some guys to spawn a bit closer to me, or I need to go catch them. Let's... Oh, yeah, one thing I wanted to do was... Wow, very, very nice shot. Was build a roof. <laughs> I need a roof. I need to make this safe. Uh, maybe I could... Uh, is there any kind of fence or entrance mechanism of any kind that I can build and it's going to be explosion proof? Bad ghast. Leave me alone. Is any of you guys angry at me? I really can't tell. No. Come on me, bros! I don't like your pigment face. Ah. Maybe I could make some sort of staircase here. Aha! Come on me! Alright, I really need some longer range the weapon, because this is a bit uh, ridiculous. How do I... Well, let's open this up and avoid guest fireball and see if any of these guys... No. Okay, let's make one of them angry and then run like mad. Oh, guest fireball is horrible news. Get in here and block yourself in and then they can reach you and then you're going to use your sword against them. Boom! There's some fires preventing me from seeing what's going on. Are there only two of you? I'm hearing more. Okay, there's one more here. Whoop! Whoa! Okay. I'm sorry, I underestimated your reach. Right, they can jump. This is actually a thing you will... It, it's kind of important to keep in mind in multiplayer PvP that uh, you can hit somebody from below easily like this, but the person above you can't... Like, do the opposite of jumping, like crouching, <laughs> getting on their knees and trying to reach you with the tip of their sword. They can't do that, so that's an important thing to keep in mind, even with pigmen. They seem... Uh, well, I'm wearing no armor, which I could, I could actually craft, uh, thinking about it, like a pair of boots. Whatever in no armor, pigmen seem to take uh, seven hearts out of you with every hit. Uh, and that's painful. Get it twice and that's it. Yeah, I'm not fishing this cast anytime soon. Look at this! Well, at least it makes it for some natural lighting, but... Uh, I think I'll focus on a roof now. Very fancy roof. Look at how fancy this roof is. Oh! Ta -da! I made a pigment safe structure. I suppose I could place a ladder somewhere. I need a well to place an extra block if I want to. Point. Leather, leather, leather. To make a leather, I need this, and hopefully, um, no gas is going to blow it up while I'm working on it. I worked. Beautiful. 
and have a single hole so I can easily up, oh, easily get out. Mostly. And then, oh, the ladder I totally could be blown up if a guest happens to aim their fireball just right. I need some, I need some easier way in. I really do. Okay, right in my face. Thank you. Thank you very much. Get down here. Maybe if I put a block here, will it be able to jump? I don't think so. If it's here. Yeah, because you need to sprint jump to do that. There we go. That's something my Z teach me. Taught me. Taught me. That's how you're supposed to pronounce that verb. Uh, whoop. You can have a nearer that you can reach, but the other mobs chasing you can't reach by just having... It uh, only be accessible by sprinting and then jumping. This here is getting a bit uh, <laughs> ugly. But yeah, this is going to allow me to get in and out without any problem. Because it can't be reached with a normal jump. Oh, it can. Barely. Um, I can either place a block, the block, one block, uh, more further back. Or I can hope that the pigment will never figure that one out. I can't make uh, things with pumpkin seeds. There we go. <laughs> I was really confused for a moment. Like, why, why are my brown mushrooms yellow? <laughs> That's a possible problem you can encounter with... Oh yeah, I can't jump on this block if... Uh... Yeah, you can't figure it out. I can jump on that block. If, yikes, I wanted to go down the ladder, but I almost to kill myself. Okay, maybe I should put the ladder like in the middle. <laughs> Instead of, be, of it being in the, on the border. Hmm. This is not yet perfect. The design needs to be improved. And I really need a longer range to fishing rod. This thing is worthless. I need to play in 1.7 and fish things up. I don't even have water around. Nom 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 Maybe I could extend the stuff? So I can try to reach this guy better? Oh, I have just realized that the fishing rod's durability gets used up every time you pull back, even though you pull back the hook even though you haven't uh, hit anything. Look, it's going to break up, oh, but it doesn't even have a sound breaking effect. That's so sad. What am I going to do? More cobblestone? All this free dirt? Are you angry at me? You are. You are very angry at me. I'm sorry I killed your brothers. Or maybe not. <laughs> Pretty sure I still haven't killed 50 of you guys though. Boink! Seems like uh, the sounds of the angry pigmen do not come from the pigmen themselves, because every time I kill the last one around, uh, the sounds keep going for a second or two. It's really strange, or maybe it's more of a thing that's... Oh, the gas hit the pigmen. Maybe it's more of a thing that's... Uh... Oh yeah, the fishing rod broke. Darn. Uh, it's a sound that comes more from the surroundings than it comes from the mobs themselves. That would be a weird behavior. I don't think so. Maybe it's just the sound lag. <laughs> we have a tiny bit too many guests around here, but we're making progress. Let's make sure not. That was so mean. The entrance of my house got blown up. Ah. Only thing that's left to verify is whether the mobs below the area where angry pigmen are, are is affected by the angry pigmen behavior. Shouldn't be though. Hopefully, really hope so. There we go. Is the wheat growing? Not really much. Maybe I should start thinking about uh, finding that. Uh, that strong gold? Where's my hole? Oh, it's here! I ha oh, I put it in the chest. Okay, I didn't mean. Why did I have the hole on me? It makes no sense, but the thing I was talking about before is I was, I was curious about whether 
the zombie pigmen in the area in the nether area would be angry directly below the police were angry than the first time because I'm not sure what the range is exactly hello maybe I should uh, surround this a tiny bit with cobblestone make sure that it's a bit safer and from ghasts go you my my butt <laughs> okay this looks this looks decent no leave me alone <laughs> that hurt you guys really really did oh there is the gas right here how's my string situation because i need to check on that too oh man Explosions all over the place. How's my string? I can't make another fishing rod. That's pretty neat. Boop. Alright. More pigment hunting and... Uh, uh, I suppose next time exploring. Because we have... Yeah, we'll start going after the cave spot spawners next time. So, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourself. And I will see you in the next episode of Super Fun Adventures.